Hi, I'm Lisa Hendy, author of The Grace of Yes. Creativity has never been one of my strong suits. I truly admire friends and coworkers who have the ingenuity to dream big. These kinds of creators don't place limits around God's capacity to amaze. I'm better at taking a dream someone else has created and making the pieces of it happen. I'm more at ease coloring within the lines someone else has drawn. Lately, I've realized by assuming that I lack creativity, I'm not giving God my full yes in my work. When my big idea moments are followed by 16 but questions, but why, but how, I stymie the creator of all. I place limits on the boundless potential God has planted within me. I have a friend who is the polar opposite of me in this way. He is an absolute idea person. He has so many ideas that he often leaves his fellow team members wondering about his capacity to actually follow through on even half of what he dreams up. At times I've looked at this person and thought he should get a better handle on his creative juices. But more recently, I've been in absolute wonder at his incredible generosity of spirit in fully giving himself to the dreams that God surely has for him. One definition of the word creativity describes this friend's capacity to brainstorm. That definition says that creativity is the ability to transcend traditional ideas and to create meaningful new ideas. When we open ourselves to the potential of the creative forces within us, we unleash the power we have to be more meaningful in our work, to leave an enhanced legacy, and to make our world a better place. With new ideas, we can often reach more people and help them to grow closer to being the persons God intends them to be. Our society's most readily identified heroes, members of the military, police officers, firefighters, and emergency medical workers, enter tough, often dangerous work environments every day. They are life lifesavers. We all see that. But a farm worker's yes to a day spent in the hot sun harvesting fruit, a plumber's shift untangling a jammed pipe, or a mom's morning with cranky toddlers and too many diapers also have inherent worth and, to, and demand to be done with dignity. God created us for work. Our work can make us holy when we give ourselves and our own unique yes to it with generous hearts and minds open to creativity. I'm Lisa Hendy. I hope you find grace in every yes. And for more, visit us at catholicmom.com.